Nothing big. Here we go. Oh, this 1961 uh, edition series one. Seven times through. For the owner names. All right, here's a lucky number seven. All right, so we're going to randomize, of course, uh, the owner names and the teams. So CJ making a prediction over here. CJ Luker has seen the light <laughs> and has made a prediction. Uh, yeah, I think the bat is next. Yes, Jason. The bat is after this one. Seven times through. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. I hope you pull something nice. Lucky number seven. I hope somebody hits something huge. I'd love to see a Roger Maris. You know, we had a Billy Williams rookie card come out of here earlier. A Billy Williams rookie, sweet swinging Billy Williams. And then we also had a graded eight Hank Aaron. So we just had a number of great hits so far, man, coming out in this box. This thing has been awesome. Fire. We have been pulling fire out of this thing. Uh, wish you the best, everyone. Good luck. Here we go. What's it going to be? It's a Joe Morgan. Look at that Joe Morgan. Oh, my. This one didn't include like a cased one. You know, we've seen a lot of these. Uh, and we've seen encased ones. So this one's different. This one doesn't have a big case uh, type one. So look at there. There's going to be a Harmon Killebrew. Uh, twins gonna get a Harmon Killebrew out of this thing. Oh my gosh! So still some great names, but we don't have the graded one like we saw with the Hank Aaron that was graded. So we've got a Joe Morgan for the Cleveland Indians and Eddie Yost. L.A. Angels, 1961 rookie, Joe Hicks for the Senators owner, Kyle, a checklist card, which it's got to be hard to find these that don't have checks because in the 1960s, a lot of the kids would actually physically use these. So I bet you that's kind of rare to have one that, a checklist that's not checked off. Here's a Dave Nicholson. 
for the Orioles. And there is probably the card of the break right there. I would probably assume that'd be the card of the break, but it's a Hartman Killebrew, Minnesota Twins. I don't know everything there is to know about 1960s, but I do know Harmon Killebrew is a great name to get. So that's good stuff uh, coming out of the 1960s break. You're right, Trey. I immediately recognize that, oh, yeah, that's the wrong Joe Morgan to get excited about. Um, but, you know, it's just good stuff. It's fun. I'm having a lot of fun ripping some vintage stuff. And uh, we... We're having some good luck out of that box. So that's fun stuff. We got more great stuff coming up too for you. 